Pesky orange traffic cones, closing lanes, stopping commuters, road construction is a common summertime site. But right now, a $246 million MoDOT project on I-55 in Jefferson County will add a third lane and improve interchanges. Drone 4 powered by Renewal by Anderson giving us that view of work from the skies today. That project, though, is sparking some pushback because of the plans to add two roundabouts at the I-55 Highway 67 interchange. And our Russell Kinsall is hearing from critics and finding out why so many roundabouts are popping up all over. Right now, I'm standing amidst the construction zone for the redesigned I-55 Highway 67 interchange. They are adding two new roundabouts. One just opened partially today. The project's not even finished, and already the critics are voicing their opinions. Do you like roundabouts? Uh, no, sir. Eric Stone regularly drives through the interchange at I-55 and Highway 67. He's one of the critics about the redesign that adds two roundabouts. Especially this one's going to be more dangerous than helpful. This was a straight shot straight through, uh, straight south on Highway 67 South. And uh, now they've put this roundabout in. Last year, MoDOT began a $246 million project on I-55, which adds a third lane from Peedley to Festus and makes improvements to interchanges. MoDOT District Engineer Tom Blair says roundabouts were the best solution for getting traffic on and off the interstate at the 5567 interchange. And it really got down to the choice, are we putting in a traffic signal or are we putting a roundabout? And in these two particular cases, adjacent next to I-55 at 67, the roundabout is the preferred solution. Blair says MoDOT has built nearly 400 roundabouts around the state. They're proven to cut down on accidents and the severity of collisions if they happen. They're okay for me. I mean, I use them. I don't have any problem with them. I could take them or leave them. I don't have an opinion either way. Don't hate them, don't love them, doesn't matter. The roundabouts will not be on I-55 and will only impact traffic getting on and off the interstate. A MoDOT worker drove through one of the roundabouts, which opened today. So here we go, driving south on US-67. As you approach the roundabout, you'll see that not all the lakes into and out of the roundabout are open. We do not anticipate opening the other lakes of the roundabout until later this summer. Whether I can ever get everybody to like or love roundabouts, I think they're going to ultimately see that they are safe and they are efficient. There's always a learning curve whenever a newly redesigned interchange opens up. This one won't be finished till 2026, but MoDOT has lots of information about roundabouts and about this project on its website to help drivers prepare. In Jefferson County, Russell Kinsall, First Alert 4.